Hey, what is going on there, YouTube? This is through 5 and I wasn't actually planning on uploading today uh, because I'm not feeling, you know, 100%. Uh, I pretty much just threw on a shirt, a uh, beanie or hat, I don't really know. And yeah, time to show you a video or time to show you people who have stolen my logo and the image and also stolen other people's content and uploaded it as their own. So you can probably hear my voice isn't the best sounding. Uh, I've got some videos recorded anyway that I'm just going to upload throughout this weekend, tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, so on and so forth. But yeah, let's get into it. So about a month ago, um, Graham or Gisa Legend, his name is on YouTube, uh, he sent me a link to someone who had my, my logo, my YouTube logo. Uh, they've obviously taken just the image, put it on their banner, and or got someone to put it on their banner. So basically, I've given them, since some point in November, I've been tweeting them like constantly. I gave them some time since November to change it, and they just didn't change it. So yeah, basically what went on yesterday is that I was alerted to another YouTube channel that has been using other people's logos, and you know, they decided to take mine. His name was, I've got him up on my screen, Orange Josh Gaming just decided to take mine. I'll probably have some video footage on screen just of me going through their stuff and their channels and stuff like that. Uh, Joshua Stockwell is his name and he actually followed um, Adam or Aid, Aid Sap, Sap, however you want to put it, um, the guy who made my logo. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty funny. You follow the guy who you stole a logo from. Uh, I contacted Adam yesterday about it because my Skype um, I'm on a different computer so it wipes things unless you're on the computer. Uh, so he gave me some screenshots of when he sent it to me, me contacting him, different things like that. And I shot an email off to copyright at youtube.com. If you don't know what that is, that is the YouTube copyright. If you're putting a claim in on something or if you just want to check up on something, you should probably email them. Uh, I sent them an email of pretty much everything, telling them or asking them to pretty much give these guys their final warning. Um, I'm not having it pretty much, you know, I don't pay for something for someone else just to copy it, download it and use it. So while I was looking through these channels and different things like that, uh, I realised that the guy called imatty underscore zero zero or matty whatever, I don't really care to be honest, he's been liking my videos and I realised that he was the one who had like the whole cutout. So yeah, I've given, I gave him like, I said on Christmas, get rid of it, you know, New Year's, get rid of it. He just didn't really listen to me, said, yeah, yeah, I'm getting rid of it. So there are two people pretty much. So the first person there was, and then there was another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. And I, I, I don't get it genuinely how people can go around doing this. So when I went on the Matty's channel, I saw that he had a video with nearly 3,000 views, 100 plus likes, 40 plus dislikes, and it was an Xbox One Gold installation. So I was watching it, and then I realized, like, he has really small arms and doesn't have any hair on his arms. I don't have any hair, but doesn't really bother me. And when you're watching the video, the hands go from being small to giant, like a man's size hands, and complete hair down the arm, like everywhere down this guy's arm, it was hairy. So I literally just searched up Xbox One Gold installation, and the top video he had downloaded and just uploaded to his channel, gaining, I'd say, between like 10 to 40 subscribers, most probably from it, and profiting from it maybe because 3,000 views on a video that you just downloaded and uploaded put like a five second intro at the start at like uh, people like this genuinely don't deserve to be on YouTube like like I really don't get where people or why people would actually do this like they actually have the nerve to copy and download someone else's images and videos and different things like that and they don't stop until something actually happens to them so I did do the whole report thing on channel art and channel icon to these two people or these two individuals um, you know it says like if your grounds aren't right then your channel will be terminated but it, YouTube pretty much like I've given all the evidence that I have I showed them like uh, Adam, the email from myself to him saying like to check Skype, um, payments gone through, different things like that. And yeah, I'm pretty much just waiting on a reply from them. 
you know, people like this, I don't, I don't know where people come off, you know, stealing other people's content, stealing other people's logos as well, like, that's just low, and it's how the guy's integrated it into his banner, thinking that he will get away with it, well, this is pretty much my way of saying, I've caught you out, like, I've given you all the opportunities, and now you will probably just pay the piper, as to say, because you had all the opportunities, like I don't get it, and you've also taken someone else's video and uploaded it as your own, like, genuinely, where do you have the nerve to steal someone else's content? I've linked the, um, the videos in the description, uh, under just like, I've called it copyright as the playlist, the guy's video and this video, it's like an over a year difference in timing, so yeah, really wanted to record today, you know, like, <laughs> uh, I don't know, maybe it's just me who doesn't understand that people need to take other people's content and other people's images that have been paid for, I don't know. It's just odd that people have the balls to copy someone else's item. Like, fuck. Peace. I don't, I, fuck this. Seriously. <laughs>